I'm Virginia Allen with the Daily Signal here in Kenosha, Wisconsin. I am standing just outside of Good Taste. It used to be the Good Taste ice cream shop, but now they've shortened their name just to Good Taste. Good Taste is one of the many businesses that was burned by rioters during the riots in Kenosha in the summer of 2020. And the Daily Signal actually spoke with the owners of this business a year ago. They were kind enough to sit down with us to give us an interview and tell us their story, what it was like to actually watch their business burn. This is owned by a wonderful family, an immigrant family from Mexico. Their father built this business from the ground up. And after they lost everything at their old location that we actually showed you all on Twitter during a live this morning, uh, their original location is only two blocks away. They are now here. They're finding success. It's dinner hour here in Kenosha, and it's pretty uh, busy inside. We walked in earlier. There's folks getting dinner. They, they sell tacos and ice cream, authentic Mexican tacos. Uh, you can see they still have the branding that they used to have. The duck is kind of their, their signature um, logo item. And uh, very, very unique little shop, but a local favorite to have a combo of ice cream and tacos. And I spoke with the owners. They are doing well. They are so thankful to have this new location and to have been able to recover. So many individuals came around them in this community and really across America to support them. They had a GoFundMe going for months in order to raise enough money to rebuy all the machinery that is needed to make ice cream. They, it's homemade ice cream. And uh, it was a long journey for them to get to this point of having their new shop. But for this Kenosha business, we are thankful that it has been a happy ending for them. The Daily Signal, we are here live in Kenosha, Wisconsin, covering the Kyle Rittenhouse trial, the verdict that was announced earlier today. We're going to be going live throughout the evening, showing you what is happening at the courthouse, but we're really pleased to bring you a little bit of good news out of Kenosha. The fact that one of the many, many businesses that was burned and destroyed in the rioting they now have a happy ending in a new location. Be sure to follow The Daily Signal on Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, so you can keep up with all of our reporting and everything that we are doing here in Kenosha, Wisconsin.